The Dallas-based animation studio Real FX is getting ready to release its second major motion picture. It's a visually striking comedy adventure, and almost all of it was created at the company's headquarters in Deep Ellum. Dan Godwin takes a look in tonight's Fox Forward. Uh. Huh? Where am I? <gasps> Welcome to the land of the remember. The Book of Life tells the story of Manolo, a young man torn between the expectations of his family and following his heart. But before he decides, he embarks on an amazing journey where he must face some of his deepest fears. Jorge Gutierrez co-wrote and directed The Book of Life, set for nationwide release next month. Thanks for coming in. Dan, thank you so much for having me. A remarkable number of people worked on this film. Yeah, over 400 people, uh, most of them in Texas here in Dallas. Uh, but then people, you know, we recorded an orchestra in London, so all over the world, literally, people were to help us. There's a lot of technology at your disposal, but it's still a very painstaking, labor-intensive oh, yeah. process. We still, you know, move animation one frame at a time. It takes roughly two to three years to make one of these. Uh, and yes, the technology keeps changing every day. But just as technology gets better, it seems like we try to push it even more. So it's always, it's always really hard. Now, Real Effects is headquartered quite a distance from Hollywood. Uh, th this studio is seeking to become you know, competitive with the really big animation studios. Is it, does it pose some challenges to be this far from the heart of the industry? Uh, in a weird way, it's a really positive thing. <laughs> to be as far away as you can from the main studios. What we're trying to do is, we're not trying to make the type of movies that the big studios are making. We're trying to make something really different, really unique. And I think the only way to do that is to not be over there. And so Book of Life is, is hopefully going to be something that, that can change things a little. You feel like this story is going to resonate with, with kids and grown-ups. Absolutely. Uh, you know, even though it, it, sets, it takes place in Mexico and it's a Latin theme movie, it's really for the whole world. Uh, the, the themes of the movie are very universal. And, and the, the beliefs of Day of the Dead, again, are really, really uh, universal. And it's, it, it incorporates elements of yes. Day of the Dead. Uh, a traditional holiday from Mexico, uh, very ancient, it's almost 2,000 years old. And this, the belief of this holiday is very beautiful. It's November 2nd. It's a celebration of the life of those who came before us. And this period you're in right now, where you're waiting for the film to be released, it, does it give you some anxiety, wondering how people are going to react, or do you have just a pleasant feeling of anticipation? Uh, you know, uh, I have a five-year-old, and I, the same feeling that we had right before he started preschool, where we weren't sure, you know, how he's going to react and how other kids were going to treat him. The movie's getting ready to go into the world, and we're super nervous, but we really hope the world embraces the film. All right, well, Jorge Gutierrez, uh, thank you so much. Best of luck. The Book of Life opens Friday, October 17th.